We are dealing with some pretty rugged terrain here. Seismologists often go where no one has ever gone before. The area we've been working in for about two years could certainly be processed in a single season. I've never gotten so much done in such a short period of time. This is an exceptional system. What makes unique technology truly unique is that it is the most advanced solution on the market. You can really call it unique, as no other company in Russia offers anything like it. We've seen what the market has to offer, and it's clear that there's no other commercial solution available that would suit our needs so perfectly. Exploring Eastern Siberia. Eastern Siberia, right here 600 kilometers away from the nearest community, is where Geotech Holdings geophysicists live and work. Every day for the past three months, despite temperatures as low as minus 40 degrees centigrade and one and a half meters of snow on the ground, they have been conducting oil field exploration for Gazprom Neft. Our seismic crew came together last November, made up of the best professionals from all over Russia. It all began with a hunting cabin in the middle of the woods. Several people came here and cleared the site with their chainsaws. Then we built some more comfortable living quarters. Now we have everything we need for working and living here. A great eating hall, a laundry room, everything. The work that Geotech holding engineers and researchers do here requires very high levels of qualifications. As this is the first exploration site in Russia where a unique high-density seismic acquisition system is being used. One of the primary technological advantages of this system is that it offers simultaneous support for a large number of recording channels, a benefit that no other system on the market can offer. Recording such a voluminous amount of data requires both high precision and extremely wide bandwidth. And Unique gives us just that. This system's optimization level and performance truly push the limits of modern technology. The oil and gas reserves of Western Siberia are located in areas with relatively simple geological characteristics. That's certainly not the case here in the east, where productive stratas are mostly buried under volcanic rock and salt beds, which makes discovering prospective sites much more difficult. This is why we need new exploration methods, and Unique gives us precisely that. The times of easy to extract deposits are long gone. Considering the geological complexity of this region, we can't go any further without innovative exploration techniques. Each sensor has its own IP address, and in case of a transmission line failure or cable cuts, we're able to redirect the data flow in any direction we need. Since a data acquisition area can cover 20 to 50 square kilometers, all its sites are interconnected. Just like a major local area network with multiple cross connections. So even a cable breakdown at a certain section won't cause the whole system to go offline. This system is highly reliable and ensures stable performance. The first stage of seismic exploration works consists of mapping future locations of data acquisition sensors and routes for vibrator trucks. To accomplish this, our topographers cover up to 7 kilometers a day, using GPS data to find their way through deep snow. They install field rods that are later used as markers for mapping exploration routes. In summer it's not possible to work here. 
We are limited by a short season from December to April, so every single day counts, and this system allows us to acquire as much data as possible in such a limited period of time. Unique technology ensures high-density data acquisition that eliminates numerous problems that we usually have to deal with when using conventional seismic exploration methods, such as the need for static corrections and noise reduction. All this allows us to achieve higher performance levels in exploration and production drilling. Whereas the standard exploration techniques we've been using until recently allow us to process 500 to 800 points a day, Last week, using this new system, we were able to handle as much as 2,000 points a day. No other system currently available in Russia provides such high reliability and performance levels. All coordinates recorded by topographers go to an in-field processing team. We feed the recorded data to the program and produce a production plan that is transferred to vibrator trucks as well as to our seismic station, where it serves as a map for what we call shooting. This so-called shooting is the process of sending a seismic signal down into the ground and acquiring the reflected signal using sensors. These sensors are installed in a strict sequence with data acquisition lines connected using fiber optic cables that form a network structure. Currently, we are exploring a total area of 350 square kilometers with about 37,000 channels. And data from all the sensors is sent to this station. After all the sensors and data transmission lines are in place, vibrator trucks come into play. Vibrator trucks are huge vehicles that carry seismic vibrators for producing seismic signals, capable of penetrating as deep as several kilometers into the earth. We stop at a designated point, send a vibration signal down into the ground, and then acquire the reflected signal and record it at our station. Our two teams are able to process up to 2,000 points in a single shift, but we are trying to increase our performance even further. And this here is our seismic station, where we collect and store the data required from all our geophones. The seismic station operates 24-7 to collect all the data required by the sensors and this ensures continuous acquisition and processing of such massive amounts of data. Once a day, the collected data is transferred over to secure hard drives and sent to the in-field processing team, where it's compared with data recorded by the vibrator devices, plotted on a map and analysed. The volume of data we collect is an order of magnitude greater than what we can achieve via conventional seismic exploration techniques. We're talking about terabytes of new data every day. Geotech Holdings engineers have been using unique technology around the clock for their exploration work for over four months now. Sometimes they have to work in temperatures as low as minus 50 degrees centigrade. Yet despite such extreme conditions, the system has been working all this time without so much as a single failure. The data collected by the system is later sent to the mainland, where geophysicists complete its processing and interpretation. This is a unique project, both for our team and for the Russian oil and gas industry overall, because no company in Russia has ever had to deal with such a gigantic amount of data before. This project's success will definitely spur further adoption of unique technology throughout Russia. This is the future. This project, implemented for Gazprom Neft in eastern Siberia using unique technology, is truly unique because it was the very first project in Russia that used this technology for high-precision, high-density seismic exploration. And the results we achieved are sure to bring us many benefits and ensure more successful drilling operations. When we talk about unique technology, we're actually talking about an integrated set of field-proven, high-quality solutions for certain tasks. 
All of these elements are generally available in the market, and you could even combine them yourself, in the same way that you could buy all the necessary parts and build a car yourself. But when we need a new car, we go down to a car dealership, because someone has already come up with the idea of how to assemble all those parts properly, to complement each other and create an efficient solution. This is what Unique is. It's an exclusive combination of technological solutions and methods for acquiring, processing and interpreting seismic data that currently has no competitors in the market. In late April, Geotech's seismic crew finished the first year of its project in eastern Siberia. Snow in the taiga will soon begin to melt, and then even off-road vehicles won't be able to get there. The quality of field data we were able to collect is tremendously high. We wouldn't be able to achieve such a high level if we used conventional methods of seismic acquisition. This is definitely a technological breakthrough for the Russian oil and gas industry. Gazprom Neft, with the support of Geotech, is pioneering this innovation. We communicate extensively with our partners and colleagues from other oil and gas companies, and they all are more than a bit envious. They constantly ask us to see our data and are anxious to implement this technology themselves. We are collecting data 24-7 under any weather conditions, no matter what. All the difficulties and limitations we used to have to deal with, well, they're just gone. I love this system. Next December, Geotech Holdings geophysicists will return to the Taiga and continue their conquest of eastern Siberia. Their heavy trucks will roam through its snowy forests and terabytes of data will flow across optical fiber cables again. They will discover new oil deposits, and when their work here is finally done, Geotech will go somewhere else to continue their exploration of Siberia.